it is unfortunate what is happening that we're starting to have this division between the the, the, the indigenous people, the Mayas, and the and the rest of our citizens. Um, there's a ruling by the CCJ, and we have to abide by it. Now we need to see how we can 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 maneuver and live side by side as neighbors, as one people, as Belizeans. There's one country, and I could assure you that our government will not give in to no balkanization that uh, the Mayas and the Creoles and the Hispanics, the Chinese, everybody needs to understand there is one government, there is one country, there is one people, and that applies down south. Now what we discussed yesterday is to ensure that we can have a, a quick response team, that whenever we have any of these uh, instances happening, that um, the police, people and the lands department, forestry department, and can move over there immediately with the, the, the lands upon where their maps to show where the lines, the delineation is between the village and the village boundaries. And then um, where it does not exist, then we need to be able to tell and listen. Everybody needs to move away and move until we can set what are going to be the boundaries. So pretty much that's what we're doing. Um, cabinet has agreed that sometime before, hopefully before the end of the year, we want to set a, a full day to be able to discuss the Maya land policy and as to how it's going to be implemented, how it's going to work, and, and to do it in such a way where we don't divide the country. I repeat again, a People's United Party government will not stand by, will not allow the balkanization of our country. Sure.